everyone. Um, I'm just going to do a quick update here. I am on cycle day 31. My period's due in three days. Um, I got a really faint positive on a first response test on Thanksgiving morning. And then I got a pregnant on a digital on Friday morning, which was Black Friday, the day after Thanksgiving, of course. Um, and I have a couple pregnancy tests that I just have here still. So I took one yesterday, I took one today, and I have one more left. I'm going to wait until I miss my period and see how dark it is. So these are the two I took um, today and yesterday. I'll show you. So I took this one yesterday, which would have put me at like 11 or 12 DPO. It's pretty dark. And then I took this one today, which it's a little darker. Not much, but still exciting. So I'm just excited they're that dark and I'm still this, you know, early as far as um, DPO. I know a lot of women don't get um, positives at all until, you know, sometimes like 16 DPO and stuff like that. So um, about how I feel, I feel very nervous. I kind of feel like it's not real because I was just pregnant, you know, two months ago when I lost my baby at 22 weeks it just all feels like I don't know I'll believe it when I see it maybe as far as when I see a ultrasound and it's good and healthy and I start showing that's I think when it'll become real to me because right now it just does not feel real at all um, I just I don't know I'm super nervous. I don't know if I should make a doctor's appointment yet. I don't know if I should. I was going, I actually was call, started calling this morning to see if a doctor I wanted was accepting new patients. And then I thought, well, maybe I should wait until I actually miss my period before I start calling. And it was really hard to get a hold of them. Like nobody was answering, kept going to recordings. And so that kind of makes me nervous because it's a really great doctor. But like, are they going to be so busy that it's going to be hard for me to ever get through to somebody? This last doctor I had, I really didn't like just because of his bedside manner. He was kind of grumpy. He was very professional and he did good work. He just, you know, I just didn't really mesh with him. But I loved his nurses and they were always calling me and getting me in for blood work and like, you know, I don't know. I'm kind of at a loss for what to do. Half of me wants to call my old doctor just because I know I can get in because they're like, you know, on the same emotional page with me. But I also want a new doctor because I want a really good experience. So, um, but yeah, we're really excited. I told my all my family just because it's like they say to wait till you're out of your first trimester. Well, I did that last time and I still didn't get a baby. So we'll see. Um, Sorry about the videos with my um, test results. I have a I, new iPhone and <clears throat> the one they sent me was like the speaker on like speakerphone and FaceTime and on video recordings doesn't work. And I'm still waiting to get a new one. So I go on my old Droid phone to make videos and I just used it off of the Wi-Fi at my house. And since we were out of town, I didn't have Wi-Fi connection. So I just really wanted to post those test results so I just kind of did it without the sound so I'm sorry about that um but yeah I just keep looking at these lines it's like I'm in shock still and it's been like four days I don't know it's just crazy you know this is the first month we tried since my loss and it's like I totally didn't expect it like you know Obviously, I really wanted it, but I never in a million years thought it would be, like, a positive when I took that test. <clears throat> and what's funny is, sorry, I uh, had two digitals and one first response with me when we went to Kansas. And Wednesday night, I did a digital. And I barely had to pee, so I kind of, like, really <laughs> had to soak the stick, and it said not pregnant. So I kind of was bummed. I was like, yeah, you know, I kind of thought so. And then the next morning on Thanksgiving, I took the first response and there was like a 
tiny barely there line and I was like yeah what if it's not there I showed Jordan and he was like those are man-made you know that I'm not gonna believe that you know he's like it's hardly there I can't even barely see it da -da 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 -da. and then when he saw the digital the next morning that said pregnant and then now all these that are clearly dark he's more excited so we'll see nervous but um thanks for all the congratulations i really appreciate it and i will try to make another update as soon as i get a hold of a doctor or whatever i might just call my old one to get some blood work done and see what my numbers are because i had some progesterone problems last time but we'll see all right well thanks for watching and i will definitely update you all sooner than later all right bye